Okay, so uh, in my other little video, I told you guys I would tell you um, kind of what these things do or what it is. This is the item that I'm getting the most questions about. People are like, what is it? What does it do? How is it going to help me? Uh, you can Google it or you can pop into Sephora and ask or, you know, whatnot. Um, these are all new. The reason that I have so many and I have a, a good amount of these is because I used to work for them and we used to give these out as gratis, which if you don't know means it's free. We would do a demo and people would come and uh, we would tell them like, oh, thank you, you know, for learning about the item. Now you can go sell it. So here it is for you to try. Uh, I've had these for quite some time. So also they were free to me and I am not going to sell them because that would be wrong. So I'm giving them away to people because obviously I only have one face and this one really isn't for um, my skin type. So, you know, it's good for you. I still have quite a few people have asked about it and I have many. So just let me know and I will send them. Um, this is the firming and lifting cream. Um, I'll just open it because I do have a few and I can use it like on my hands or something. This retails for, let me see, I think I looked it up. It retails for $96. Um, it's good for up to a year once you've cracked it. Um, it is a cream situation like this. And it's really light and, you know, good for wrinkles and all that good stuff. Like I said, um, look it up. It is a moisturizer for firming and lifting and keeping all the lines in check and all that good stuff. There really isn't, like, you know, it's for any anyone. My skin is really crazy dry. It is very, very hydrating, but I prefer to use from the same brand an even more hydrating one. So... There you go. That's what that is. Um, the samples that I have too are from the Genius Cream. This is the one that I um, usually use. Uh, this is like a mini one. It's 0.23 ounces. I believe the full size one is an ounce and a half when you purchase it. And I think that one's 150, 110 to 150. Um, this is really neat. It does come in the full like it's just a mini version of the full size one. It's like the hard metal and glass bottom situation. And it's great for like traveling. And I'll send a couple of these in there for you. And this one is a lot richer and creamier. So if your skin is oily, maybe give it to your mom or something or someone that has really dry skin. Um, I like this one a lot because it smells a little bit vanilla-y. Um, this one is fragrance free. So there you go. I know that they're hypoallergenic and all of that good stuff and it is all made in the USA right here in San Francisco so um, support local business okay that's that one um, really quick I'm gonna show you guys some items that I'm gonna be giving away tonight or tomorrow um, they're packaged so I don't want to sit and take a million pictures of them I'm just gonna show you real quick what they are um, item number one is the Mac Selena Amor Prohibido. It's from the very first release. Ooh, something just fell out of it. And I bought a few of these when I first got them off the Canada website. And this one's super pretty. I am... Am I wearing this now? What the heck? Oh my gosh. This is lies. So, this one, the inside actually says Dreaming of You, but the outside says Amor Prohibido. So, I am wearing Dreaming of You right now. I might have a box for it somewhere because, as I mentioned before, I am a hoarder, so I keep all my boxes, which I'm trying to get rid of. So I'll find you the right box, if that's what you're into. Anyway, it's brand new, I never used it. I bought too many, so boom, there you go. Um, the next one is another limited edition from MAC called Embrace Me. This one came out actually a few years ago. Um, all of my backup makeup, which basically means I buy duplicates because they're limited or they're inexpensive or for whatever reason. They all live in my freezer, which keeps them um, from going bad. And I don't really crack them. So, you know, use at your own risk. This one is called Embrace Me. If you want more information on the color, Google that sucker. 
The next one is Sounds Like Noise. This one was another limited edition, and this one was a collaboration with Haley Williams, the lead singer of Van Paramore. Um, it's this beautiful, electric, shocking orange. I love it. I wear it often. It is a matte, or is it a retro matte? It is a matte lipstick. Um, I really like it. It's very pigmented. I've used it before, obviously, because I have another one, and I really love it. It pops a lot. I wore it to like one of our concerts, so... It's great. I love it. I'll probably send those out as like a set or something. I don't know. The other one is going to be a Love Goddess. This one was from the Marilyn Monroe Connection again a year back. It, I think it's a red or a pink. Might be a red. I usually buy duplicates of the red because I feel like I wear so many red and then I have too many red lipsticks. Again, really pretty. This one's a pinkier red versus the... Um, What's it called? The Dreaming of You is a more wine. Um, there you go. That's Love Goddess. Uh, that one's really cute. It has like a label on the inside. To keep your packages. This is a really cute one. Um, the other item is going to be the Archie's Girl collection. Also by MAC. It's so cute packaging. Again, this one is older. This is a powder though. Um, it has not been cracked. This is Prom Princess. I'll probably take a picture of mine um, just so I don't crack the seal on this. Um, it is a bright pink fuchsia. It is extremely pigmented. If you liked the what was it? The Disney collection, The Villains, that which came out years and years and years ago. This is very similar to The Villains in The Maleficent. I do find that this one is a tiny bit chalkier than The Maleficent, but it's essentially a very, very similar uh, purpley pink. Um, packaging looks like that. I don't know if it matters, but... Um, then I'm going to give these away altogether because like shipping on one of these, that would be stupid. Um, and this is an Anastasia collection. Again, these were all gratis from when I worked at a cosmetics store. Um, I did a training with them, like an eyebrow training with Anastasia, and they gave me all this stuff. And of course, my hair is super black, and none of this stuff really suits me. It is brand new and never used. This is Brow Fix, a clear wax pencil. It's supposed to be like a clear situation there. You can see it's brand new. I never used it. Um, it's a good product. It just shows a lot on my super black eyebrows. Uh, this is a matte highlighter crayon. I don't usually highlight with cream. Again, it's super stark against my black. I'm not into looking like a clown. Um, this is the perfect brow pencil in a color which is medium brown, again, too light for me, again, brand new. I think most of things just to be light, soft brown. This is the Brow Wiz, and this is the Brow Pen in Universal Deep. This one's the marker kind. I believe they stopped making it. Um, I'm not sure if you can use it as eyeliner, but I do know that it's a brow tint, so it's really good if like they're really sparse, or if you're really into like a really, you know, like the Instagram super deep brow situation, that's that's what's going to be in that Anastasia set. Um, this one I'm probably going to send alone, or maybe I'll find more Disney things to throw in with it. If you are a fan of Disney and Sephora, you remember these. They're super hot. I have too many of them. <laughs> so you get one. It says, you've got to be you. And this is the Ariel Compact. Set the Mood Compact Mirror. Um, it comes in this foamy thingy. I have mine in my bag, so I probably should have just done that. It still has the plastic on it. And on the inside it says, you've got to be you. Oh, look, the camera. Oh, the stuff, it's me. Oh, yeah. That's that one. This one is pretty heavy because it's metal and glass. So if you're not prepared to pay for shipping for this, um, don't try to get it. Um, okay, this is getting long, so that's it. Again, with all of these items, I think every single one of the items that I just showed you, aside from the cream, was a limited edition item. You can try to get these things on eBay, um, because you can't buy them at the store anymore. 
but I'm giving them to you for free, so please don't put them on eBay. It will make me sad. And that's it. More stuff at another time.